What's up, dude? So we're going to do Hillsong Revolution. This one's a little bit more difficult. It's got a lot of different beats, a lot of different parts. So what we're going to do is we're just going to focus on the chorus. And this is called a breakbeat. So that's why I actually wanted to do this song is it's got a bunch of different beats that you can add to your arsenal and kind of um, get to know a bunch of different ones that, that in the same song that you can actually apply to different songs. Um, this is a, a breakbeat is a beat that's not your standard, you know, snare on three, kick on one, two, that kind of thing. Uh, your snare could be on four, and your snare could be on and, your kick could be on the ands and all that, and so it's just kind of like all over the place as far as that goes. So it's a little bit, a little bit complicated, um, but it's a two-part loop. Your first part is going to be kick on one, two, snare on three, four, okay? So kick, kick, snare, snare, all right? So just put it put it together it's going to be one two three four count them like that okay but it's going to be kick kick snare four so here we go one two three four kick kick snare snare okay so kick kick snare snare one two three four okay one two three four okay one two three four okay so that's all it is so you're actually doing kick kick, snare, snare. All right, so then where it gets confusing is the second part of the two-part loop. When it starts coming around second, you know, count of four, you're actually gonna add a kick. After the snare on four, you're gonna add a kick on the and. So, and one, okay? And so your kick is gonna be on and one, and then you're gonna do a snare on and two, okay? So this, the kick and the snare, the second part of the loop, are on the ands. <laughs> and so you're actually just hitting the hi-hat by itself with nothing else and the kick by itself and the snare by itself. And then um, you're going to, uh, you know, hit, so you hit hi-hat one by itself, hi-hat two by itself, and then you're going to add in another kick on and three. And then you're going to come down and hit the snare and the hi-hat at the same time on three. Okay, so second part of the loop is kick on and one snare on and two, kick on and three, and then snare on three, okay? <clears throat> so putting it back to back, it's gonna sound like this, so. Okay, so that's all it is. So, or so sorry. Uh, okay, so if it gets confusing, just do that second part by itself. Okay, so that's pretty much all it is. Um, it's a little bit faster, and it's actually on the ride over here because it's during the chorus. <coughs> but uh, that's pretty much basically all it is. So we'll we'll count it off and do the whole thing uh, twice. Okay, so here we go. Cool. So let me know if you have any questions. Um, then we'll probably go into the intro, uh, which is just, it's like kick. And then it's like snare fills. And okay, so that's pretty much all the intro is. But um, there's just a lot of other stuff that, you know, kind of goes into it. And it's a cool song to play. So we'll, we'll work on it. Anyways, peace. Talk to you later, dude.